Everyone, Kid Sean here. So welcome back to another Fate Grand Order video. So last night we got a surprising little update. Uh, was not expecting it, honestly, but uh, it's here. The John News got buffs. Um, I mean, this is great. French servants are freaking eating, man. Like literally, John News fans are eating. Uh, Marie Antoinette fans, uh, aka me, is eating. Um, Dante's fans are eating. Like literally, uh. Yeah, again, French servants are super, super eating uh, this year. I mean, White Day, we just had White Day, Charlemagne, the Paladins. Like, it, it, it's pretty crazy right now to see all these French servants getting buffs or animation updates. Uh, and then just get, uh, all these, you know, servants coming out and stuff like that. Like, it's pretty crazy right now. Like, I, I, I don't know what Lasango is cooking right now, but all I know is... It's pretty crazy. These updates that uh, we've been getting recently, insane. Like, literally insane. Like, it was, like, worth the wait, which I do want to talk about um, my uh, perspective on how long it took Ordeal Call Chapter 2 to come out. But let's go ahead and focus on the buffs here. Let's first talk about uh, Ruler, Janu Ruler. So the skill that got buffed for Janu Ruler is the first skill. Uh, originally, it was just getting critical stars. Every turn for three turns, uh, three to nine stars, and that was obviously a skill that we all thought needed the buff. Like, I think, no question, like, I think everyone could 100% uh, agree with me. I mean, the third skill, too, I, I do think the third skill needs something, but John knew was pretty, pretty whatever, honestly. Uh, she did get a buff before on her MP, making her. Uh, obviously better as a tank um, and uh, as, as a somewhat of a support but obviously she fell off um, pretty quickly uh, especially with you know uh, servants like uh, Castoria, Hohenheim and all, all, all those really good art servants uh, but her first skill now has a lot of things going on um, so you have Increased party's art performance for three turns. So obviously she can help out art servants when it comes to like uh, farming and like uh, buffs. I mean, against bosses and such. Uh, obviously, this is not going to make her like, hey, replace Castoria or anything like that. No, 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 no. Don't, don't get me wrong there. But uh, she does have an art buff for three turns, which is, again, really, really nice. Uh, 10 to 20 percent. Uh, and then you have the charge MP gauge, party's MP gauge, 10 to 20 percent. So that's really cool. And then you also, again, have the stars, but the stars uh, are 5 to 15 now. Obviously, they have a plus six now uh they again they were originally nine which was a very awkward number but now it's 15 which is huge and the cooldown time is actually the same six which is fair I, I think that's great so obviously this makes her so much better when it comes to the first skill she is now uh a servant that you kind of want to bring now to a boss fight to a challenge uh challenge quest uh, such like that Obviously not a, a farming support or anything like that, but um, I, I feel like this is maybe a sign that we might see some really crazy challenge quests or boss fights in the future uh, where tanks might actually be a thing. Uh, again, uh, we recently just had Andromeda. Uh, she's a tank, right? Uh, we, we all can agree with that. Crit critical tank support. We, we all can agree with that. So for some reason, I feel like, like hey, we should probably buff John New because there might be some masters that want to use an arts party instead. So I, th I think this is going to be very interesting. Um, I, again, I speculate that maybe tanks will be something that we're going to be using in the future for uh, FGO. Uh, now let's go ahead and talk about John New Alter. So John New Alter, obviously uh, a fan favorite and uh, her first skill is getting oh no sorry her third skill is getting the buff and honestly it's not too crazy it's just something like oh finally she got one so um originally increase own buster performance for one turn 30 to 50 percent grant self invincibility and then the 500 percent chance to add uh deal a thousand damage without killing herself uh that's a demerit right all that stuff stays, but it's added on with a 50 percent mp battery at level 10 so 30 to 50 percent I mean, yeah, take it. That's great. Uh, she can now, you know, get her MP faster. Uh, I, again, this is nothing too crazy. It's like, oh, 
yes, she finally got that 50% battery. She's modernized now. So, yeah, nothing too crazy on Janu Alter, but this is definitely something that I think a lot of Janu fans would be happy about because it's an MP battery. Like, who wouldn't be... Uh, happy with with an mp battery i mean this is great like it's a server that never had an mp battery so uh it's great to see that she finally has one like again we we want to see all these servers have some kind of mp battery and janu got the 50 percent treatment so yeah that's great so yeah these two great amazing like i think these buffs are are great uh i again i'm super excited about the janu one because uh i i do feel like tanks might be uh something that we, we're going to be using again so uh, again great to see all these french servants get some kind of uh get some kind of like treatment here and um yeah it, it's pretty crazy like i i, I want to know what type moon is cooking right now i want to see what fgo is cooking right now in story wise and like gameplay wise like that that's something that i think a lot of fans aren't really looking at when it comes to like these buffs like i i always look at these buffs as like okay they're cooking something for future content and um i mean yeah I, again i think the john buff is huge really really huge so hopefully they do add something crazy uh so that we can actually use these tanks like again like uh, uh, fgo not really a game where like tanks are some uh, are useful but like, again challenge quests and boss fights like you, you kind of want to use them because you want to protect your servants because challenge like uh, unlike you know farming quests challenge quests do take some time but anyways uh, that's basically about it thanks for watching hope you guys enjoyed and uh yeah let me know in the comment section below what you guys think about these buffs and i'll see you guys in the next one laters